Hi, in today's video, we'd like to demonstrate the Navix Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Smartphone Mirroring, and Backup Camera Interface for the 2011 through 2014 Dodge Charger. If you have a different vehicle, please make sure to go to Navix.com and check out our solutions for your car. To access Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, you press and hold the middle button on the right side of the steering wheel for 7 seconds. We already connected our iPhone wirelessly. iPhone can connect wirelessly and wired for CarPlay. Android Auto works wired at the moment. So let's start scrolling through the functions. Everything is done using the factory buttons on the back of the steering wheel. So we'll go to Vase first, we'll launch that. All right, let's change the size, zoom out a bit. All right, let's go over to Google Maps. We'll just show you a few of the most popular apps because we are trying to show mirroring Android Auto and the backup camera in this video as well. All right, let's, uh, let's change the view. There we go, let's ask Siri for help. Siri, can you show us the closest movie theater? I couldn't find any theaters near me. Alright, you can always ask Siri for help. Um, let's go for um, a music, let's see, let's play some audio that we have saved on the phone. Alright, now we'll show you mirroring using an Android phone and then we'll show you Android Auto. So to switch inputs, you're just going to hit the button on the back of the steering wheel for, for half a second and I'll switch over to the mirroring function. So we, the unit gives you an HDMI input and we've connected the Android phone using the USB-C to HDMI cable. So we'll show you YouTube since Vase and, and Google Maps you can get from Android Auto. Oh, let's just find another video. Right, and now we're going to switch um, to Android Auto. We'll disconnect the iPhone. All right, already all launched on Vase. So let's uh, change the view on Vase. All right, let's show Google Maps. Now we'll ask our Google Assistant for help. Okay, Google. Please show us the closest Dunkin' Donuts. And there's a Google Assistant helping us find us the closest coffee shop. Um, let's go to uh, TuneIn Radio. Just hear some audio.
All right, and there you go. That's the Navix Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, and smartphone mirroring. This, we also added a backup camera using this interface. All right, if your car has the factory backup camera, it'll continue to work the same way. Using a unit, you can also access this camera at any speed. So if you want to tow something, you can look at your trailer. Or just make sure your bike rack is still attached. 